Good afternoon. For those who are new, I'm Dr. Theron Sherman, and in today's briefing we will be discussing SCP-8401. There isn't any objectionable material in this document, so let's begin. Item Number SCP-8401 Classification Level 2 Restricted Containment Class Keter Disruption Class Vlam Risk Class Notice Special Containment Procedures SCP-8401 is contained in a standard small animal aquarium at Site-58. It has been microchipped with a small, waterproof GPS tracker. Should SCP-8401 be absent from its tank for a period of longer than 30 minutes, the tracking data is to be consulted and SCP-8401 recovered as soon as possible. Description: SCP-8401 is an axolotl, genus Abastoma mexicanum, of average size and weight. It is capable of speech and believed to be sapient, though it has not responded clearly to any lines of questioning or attempt at conversation. SCP-8401 is also capable of long-range teleportation. When SCP-8401 detects that an individual has been injured, it will teleport to the individual. It is unclear what criteria SCP-8401 follows to determine who to teleport to. An abbreviated log of appearances prior to containment has been transcribed below. Date, August 30th, 2024. Number of fatalities, 27. Notes. Discovered following Chaos Insurgency Raid on Site-17. Injuries range from bullet wounds to major head trauma. Anomaly de-manifested when spotted. Date, September 4th, 2024. Number of fatalities, 54. Notes. Discovered following large-scale containment breach at Site-34. Anomaly dove into a deceased agent's open chest and vanished before it could be captured. Date, November 18th, 2024. Number of fatalities, zero. Notes. Discovered at Site-58 after Dr. Rosemary stubbed his toe against his desk. Anomaly escaped out the office door when Dr. Rosemary attempted to grab it, de-manifesting. Addendum 8401-1. Discovery. SCP-8401 was initially discovered atop the corpse of Agent Drew Mayweather, who perished in a small-scale containment breach at Site-19. It was initially handled with extreme care, believed to have been the reasoning behind the agent's death. Containment procedures were relaxed following review of Agent Mayweather's body cam, which has been transcribed below. Forward! Extraneous footage removed! Begin log! Agent Mayweather crawls over to a nearby wall and leans himself against it. He pants heavily, holding a hand against his stomach. He pulls his hand away, revealing a large gash in his torso. Shit. Shit. It's really over, huh? Mayweather exhales sharply and slumps back. <sighs> Guess I should have seen this coming. I just... Mayweather looks around. He exhales sharply. <sighs> Wish I wasn't going to die alone. SCP-8401 manifests midair and lands in his lap with a soft thud. Agent Mayweather jolts. Hiya! What the hell? Golly, mister. You don't look so good. What? Looks like you've got a nasty owie there. Golly gee, that must hurt a bunch. Yeah, it... <coughs> Mayweather sputters, coughing a small amount of blood that splashes on SCP-8401's face. Yay! Confetti! Mayweather shudders. <sighs> Tell me, does it hurt an axe a little? Or an axolotl? Mayweather falls over, unresponsive. Mister? And the log. Alright class, that ends today's briefing. And I must admit, I think I'd rather go the way of Mayweather than listen to that voice do axolotl puns any longer. Interesting bit about that seeing blood as confetti though. Its perception of reality can't be that far off if it recognized the agent was injured, but it also didn't recognize that he had perished. Curious. What do you think? 
Write me up a report of your interpretation of this anomaly's mindset. I'll expect it in the comments by 2100. Dismissed. Thank you for listening. Site42 Studios and its staff are funded by viewers like you. Please become a patron or visit our merch store at the link in our bio to support our work. Secure. Contain. Protect.